in this situation. Well, I just want to make yeah. this clear. I don't know if you guys agree. Do you agree if a woman opens her legs for you because we in this table can all marry a McDonald's working poor woman, but a woman cannot take a chat from McDonald's and marry them? They don't have the DNA to. What, what you're agreeing to is if she opens her legs for you, she's admitting you're above her. That's why they say I want equal height or above, equal money or above, but it's always above. Women date up, meaning if they're dating you, you're better than her. It's Women not want, fucking rocket science. The average woman is 5'4". The average man is 5'9". Women want equal height or above because men tend to be taller than them. And men tend to earn more money than out? women. Of course they want something that you, in general out earns them. That's so, just averages. So you didn't answer. Right? Do women date up? Mm. In do women date? Okay, you no, know, women date about their class. Okay, do men date? Women uh, men date about their class. Men date men down. date about their class. Men, you, you men go to Walmart. You'll see a Chad with a fat ass bitch in Walmart. Walmart. Men, raise your hand if you date down. Where this you, just a topic we all we date never, down. No, none of us ever agree on this. I understand it, but the reality is, is genuinely wealthy people don't date the woman at McDonald's or Starbucks or Target. I know you guys disagree with that, but it just doesn't happen. When you're in wealthy families, and also, and when you're thinking about the mother for your children, you don't want just like a hot 18-year-old Latina with a huge fucking ass. You want an educated woman that knows how to handle her shit that's, that's gonna raise your kids. That's, that's gonna be the mother of your kids. It is relevant. Men, I found your mom in McDonald's and I turned her into the ideal mother. It doesn't make any fucking alone. sense. Leave my mom alone. Do men, yes or no, do men date down? No, not the, generally. No. no. Do women date down? No. Say never. People date about their average. <laughs> what do you think is the average difference between a man and a woman's age in a relationship? What, what's that have to do what with What do you think anything? is the average difference in age? If I, I'm if just curious. What do you think is the average difference in age? What do you think happens when you when I age 10 years? Hold on. Is it the same ever. if I age 10 years? I'm just a richer, hotter, bearded up uh, sexist. If she ages 10 years, <laughs> i got a fucking raisin Twinkie filled with cum. <laughs> How the fuck is it the same thing, bro? My value goes up with the age. You don't agree with that? It, I mean, it depends on what capacity. That's it, it, the Ideally, that, that's the mother of your children, right? Is she a used up raisin okay. Twinkie filled with fucking cum? Okay. Is that what you refer to the mother of your children? He said, like, he said what capacity? So if my finances... This is also oh, what... Okay. If, my finances, oh, if my finances and status is going up, plus my network, because I have more women at Zerka 35 versus 25... We can agree. What, what what angle are you looking at? All angles. I win when I age. She loses in every metric as she ages. To you, she does. To the no, to the world. Okay. Because we're reading statistics. You love statistics. I mean, what I think, statistics? I think we wouldn't even acknowledge the difference in age Leonardo, between a man and a woman. Okay. Look at let's look at Ronaldo. Ronaldo is not statistics. Okay. Leonardo well, DiCaprio is not statistics. That's why I asked you very simply. What's the average difference okay, between a man and a woman? Right, right. It's less than three years. The People name tend for, to date okay, the, the people name, in their same socioeconomic class, same race, don't drop, same neighborhoods, you're dropping, same schools. You're going to drop the last few chromosomes. Same religions. Look at this. <laughs> Delete the name Leonardo DiCaprio, but think of a man on his level. All of them are with 18, 19-year-old That's year not girls. true, though. We just they brought up, what did I just bring up? Bezos fucking married another woman who's, what, 50 years That's fucking That's a name. Old. That's Looking a name. Out. I'm going Leonardo off statistics. DiCaprio is a name. Do rich, wealthy men date younger women? Yes. No, on average, what the people are. Fuck, yeah. nigga? Uh, no, dude. <laughs> I'm all I the hard art. You're making you're making the emotional argument. All I can do is build the data. I can't. I can't. I, if you want to cry and and make the faces uh, yeah, or whatever, that's them. fine. What do you guys no, say? you don't ask them. Go look it up. At rich people look that are up. genuinely wealthy, not people that are in fucking yachts in Dubai bragging about fucking twenty year olds that are actually thirty five year old prostitutes that they pay to put on their boats. Actual wealthy people tend to date and marry people that are about their age. Go to any neighborhood with lawyers and doctors. But and they're shit. cheating with a bunch of fucking they eighteen might be year olds. That's, the point. That's not that wasn't your so question. Their values that up. wasn't your question. They're cheating the question with a bunch of teenagers. Cheating or not? The question is who do they marry? No, no, but they, their values up. If he's old and his scrotum hangs to the ocean <sighs> on his yacht, why is there so many young girls around him when his wife's not around? Because his value's up as he grayed, as his scrotum got gray. That's what the point I'm making. Women's value doesn't go up with the way they age. It just doesn't. I think what he's, I, I think the bottom line here is that men are more willing to concede and date a woman and or hook up with a woman that has lower value than themselves versus women are less likely to go ahead and take that dating approach. I think that's the bottom line that we can less? take where you guys are, uh, that you guys are, you know. Rifting about. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, I, I mean, like, in, in, in some in some generalities, it might be true, but it, but when you look at the data, people just tend to date around their own classes. People go to the same schools with each other. People work the same jobs each other. They're in the same neighborhoods. It's pretty rare that you get a guy with the last name Rockefeller or Kennedy that's going to Starbucks and picking up the barista. That just doesn't happen on average. You're actually saying that women will marry a Chad with a six pack that works at McDonald's. You're destroying lives with your opinion what are you talking about you're giggling out of the matrix Andrew i don't even Dave. know what you're i don't even know Andrew. <laughs> say on camera women have the dna to marry a chad that works at mcdonald's 
Say it. Bite the women, bullet. Bite the bullet. Women that it. work at McDonald's will marry men that work no, at McDonald's. No, no, yes. well, that's That's wrong, too. But you're saying women will date a Chad who works at McDonald's. Mary, bro, nigga, that's a ring. Not like Adam 22. Do you think that people that work in fast food don't have wives? <laughs> to say that to the camera. Say, if you work a service <laughs> job, you don't have a wife. Is that true? When Say that. No yeah, man, no 35-year-old man this who works at, no 35-year-old man who works at McDonald's Wild. is married, bro. Okay, okay. They're never right. married. There's no and, working right. class families. None of these poor broke motherfuckers have a wife. And it's just rich men if, with five wives I'll constantly you all over still, the United here, States. Here, here, I'll give Everybody's it, a Mormon now. I'll, I'll, here's Exodia. Uh -huh. All right. Draw, draw your last <laughs> draw your last pathetic card. I'll give it to him. Even if you I triggered call, my say, card. Let's say mm -hmm. I didn't win that one. Let's say he won that one. Yeah. I'll say, oh, okay, so there's McDonald's workers who have wives. He's really saying a woman who's about to leave him for financial insecurity, and they initiate all divorces, and she's cheating on him. So it's not really a marriage. It's kind of like he's ready to kill How himself. How is she going to leave him for financial security? Who's going to marry her? Okay. Are rich people take are rich people wiping up multiple poor women Every to give them financial security? You know, hold on. Bro. You know that when you're a rich guy and you just fuck a poor chick, she doesn't get financial security for you. You know Steven, that, right? You know, right, dude, I don't want to get you in trouble with your wife. Oh. Us four, oh. us four That's in this table. Okay. Us four in this table, fresh, Myron, Zerka, Destiny. Mm. If we met a model with a nice ass, she's sweet and loyal, works at McDonald's. I promise you, us four would say, fuck a prenup, bitch. Take half. Let me go inside you, bitch. <laughs> All of us would marry that girl. If any woman you know met a Chad that's funny and he's great <laughs> and he's perfect, but he's 32 years old and works at McDonald's, why you can't think of one fucking example is because it's never happened in history. Well, aren't, what, you literally, what, what, aren't you literally the example? How? Because six months ago, you were a loser that fucking didn't even turn his fucking stream on and you got girls all over you, don't you? I had status. What Network? status? Your I status was, was, your status was your I had 200,000 followers when yeah, I was 200,000 followers. What the fuck does that mean? Your status was 500K overnight 10 years earlier on an Austin show. And, and why the example whoa, whoa. that you're looking for? Whoa, check the it chick out. that was dating you that was abusing you was exactly a 19 year old. I'm not going to say the girl that he was in a relationship with you for one year. You had no money, no, no cash, oh, no I, help I, on Twitter, no clout, no stream, no nothing. You are the example that defeats your argument. Hey, you're not obelisk the tormentor because we were at a rooftop party. I'm not going to say the bitch's name. I hate her. She, you cucked me because I only had fucking 200 viewers when we went to TwitchCon as you were tripping on shrooms like, uh, uh, and remember when she was all over, you know who I'm talking about, that taller kind of, I know, she's tall. a lovely woman, but I didn't, no, she's like not a lovely woman, in any other, she gets aroused for someone like me, she even said, sir, that you'd be a good fuck on the show, but... The, ignore, the first time I ever got ignored because I was around influencers for the first time in my life. Yeah. I said the fucking Papa Smurf took my bitch. And I didn't we even try. Had I didn't try to get the bitch. But I was like, why didn't she even look at me once? She's just thinking about absorbing cloud off this dude. Bro, they did up. We didn't she even, saw bro, I didn't even do lower. I did like two streams of it. She didn't even get to absorb any fuck her. Don't it's not yeah. relevant. Yeah. It's a program. You fucked my no dream girl. <laughs> <laughs> All right.